thing is a beach buggy, but it's kind of a one-off beach buggy. So tell us about the Bugs Buggy, John, and uh, what makes this thing cool? So the Bugs Buggy was designed by Harry Bradley. It was originally a model, a 120 scale model. And Bob Larravee, who ran the Autorama, wanted a full-size model made. So we contracted Chuck Miller to build a full-size edition of the model. Yeah, this thing is absolutely gorgeous, and the color is my favorite part. Now, you kind of had a, a big part in, I would, restoring would be the right word? Well, what happened was the original one um, throughout the years, we nobody could find it. So we searched all over for it, and it's just not around anymore. So what I did with the help of Chuck Miller, I created a recreation, so I recreated it. Yeah, and you absolutely killed it. Now, tell us a little bit about what goes into building a ride like this. Uh, I started off with a 1969 dune buggy, a regular Myers Mannix dune buggy. And I started off with pretty much just pictures. Uh, I got measurements from Chuck Miller and I started off with cardboard. And I designed the front out of cardboard. I cut pieces, put everything together. Um, the back is plywood. And then what I did was I got fiberglass. I fiberglassed and matted over it. And then after that, I body worked the whole car and I painted it all at home. Yeah, this, you you killed it. Like I said, I love this color. There's so much detail in this thing. Um, Thank you. Yeah, you you certainly did the original, you know, yeah. right. And um, I don't think you could have came out any better. Yeah, well, I had a good teacher right here that uh, pretty much you know, taught me uh, the recipe on it. So was there any peculiar, you know, challenges or weird stuff that made this difficult to put together? Uh, a little a little bit was the rear exhaust because it's a custom one-off exhaust. And I mean, there's so many bends and twists and turns to it. Uh, that was a little challenging, but in the end result, it was pretty good. It, it was a fun experience. Yeah, no, like so this, is, this is certainly a fun build. And like I said, I, I don't think you could have did it any better. Now, yeah. is there any other shows you plan on taking this to this year? Yeah, this is going to Chicago uh, World of Wheels next week. And then from there, it's going to the Dead Man's Curve Wild Hot Rod Weekend, Labor Day weekend. That's awesome. Well, we can't wait to see it out and about and you know, check this thing out at a couple other shows. We really appreciate you taking the time to Thank talk you. to us about this, John. And like I said, you killed this. Thank you very much. Yep. So make sure to like and subscribe to our Summit Racing YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our latest videos. So until next time, I'm Justin with Summit Racing and thanks for watching.